Listen, Paul, how do we think this show is going so far? And don't be afraid to be brutal. Well, not to be a total bitch, but my five-timer show in December was going to be a lot better. That is, until the whole cast decided to call out sick. They all had COVID. So what? I have COVID right now. I got it from the queen. Humble brag. <laughs> Hi, uh, I think I'm supposed to be in here. Oh, Megan Mullally! As I live and breathe. Welcome to the Five Timers Club. Thank you, Candace. Wow, this place is amazing. Well, congratulations, John. And let me be the first person to say, who are you? <laughs> Well, Candace, you wouldn't know me, but if you have a niece or a son who's bad at sports, they might. <laughs> oh, come on. This is John Mulaney. Congrats, man. Tonight, it's all about you. And me, to a degree, as well, because, <laughs> you know, my party was canceled <laughs> due to laziness. Wow, well, I'm just happy that you're here in my episode. <laughs> and Paul Rudd exits. <laughs> well, that, that's it? Just reading, sorry, buddy. And <laughs> Tina Fey enters. I, uh, it's a nice one, John. I love how us writers control everything with stage direction. <laughs> and Tina is handed a drink by a new cast member whose name is, I want to say, Philip. It's uh, James Misfay. That's what I said, <laughs> Philip. What, uh, what kind of drink is that? Hmm. It's the Five Timer Fizz. It's made with Justin Timberlake's tequila, Dan Aykroyd's vodka, and Tracy Morgan's club soda, which is aquarium water. <laughs> Gross. Dan Aykroyd's vodka? Listen. <laughs> I have to say, I had no idea people got treated this well. You know, when I worked here, I was just a writer. Well, you were one of the best. I mean, you wrote that character with Bill Hader and uh, 800 other things that aged terribly. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, well, that's all behind you. Tonight, you're in the company of comedy legends and the sexiest man alive. <laughs> this silly thing. Paul, that was so 2021. I'm talking about Mr. Elliot Gould. Oh, hello. Oh, my God, Elliot. Well, Paul may have People magazine, but I was named Sexiest Man Alive by Chest Hair Magazine. <laughs> Hey, Elliot, do you remember being on my sitcom? Should I? <laughs> well, John, we have some business to discuss. Um, the club here has gotten so big that in order for you to get in, someone has to retire. Too bad no one here is at retirement age. <laughs> you are 76. But I am the child of a 38-year-old. <laughs> And we can't get rid of Tina. She was the first woman to ever wear glasses on TV. That's true. Entertainment Weekly called it disgusting. <laughs> and it can't be Candace. I mean, she was back here in the 70s. Can you imagine the sexual harassment that happened back then? Oh, yeah, I made those guys do really weird stuff. I was fine with it. <laughs> so are you saying there's no room for me? Well, this was supposed to be a very small club with just the highest quality of stars. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yeah, so what you're saying is... I think what we're all trying to say is this has become not special. <laughs> Did somebody... doing here? I'm just here to sign up for Peacock. <laughs> it's weird they make you do it in person. Wow. Look, John, don't listen to them. This is very, very special. I was in the very first Five Timers Club special, uh, Club Back Specs thing. When I, <laughs> <laughs> when I was a writer here. Yeah, okay. Well, a lot of us were
were writers here. Yeah, but you were on the show when you were a writer. So shut up! <laughs> John and I were never supposed to be on TV. We're hideous, right? Say it, John. I, I, I guess. Yeah. We are. And we're here and we're taking what's ours. When it's taken by that horns, it's ours! <laughs> You start here and you can do great things. I hosted my own TV show for decades. And and what are you doing now? I have a podcast. <laughs> well, I never thought I'd say this, but Conan has a point. Being in this club is pretty damn special. Yeah, yeah, come on, let's give him his jacket. All right, Paul, give him your jacket. <laughs> oh, man, you know, it was fun while it lasted. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, shit, John. Guys. Everyone, thank you. This this really does just mean the world to me. Yeah. And one more thing. Live from New York! No, it's... Conan, we, we did that already. I'm doing it anyway. Live from New York! 